What's good, y'all? It's Boy Ross back at again with another video. So we're gonna check out top ten Chris Jericho greatest catchphrases. Uh, Jericho, I, I do see more people showing love and appreciation for him being the goat that he is. I know a lot of times we talk about Stone Cold, The Rock, The Undertaker, uh, Undertaker, Triple H. You gotta put Jer Jer uh, Jericho in that because he is the one wrestler out of so many years of doing this finds a way to keep himself fresh I, I mean there's name me a time an era of Jericho that it just didn't seem like it was that it was just seem redundant it seemed stale no he he always finds a way to make his character seem new and fresh it's the same Jericho but it's always something different you know and that's something that you know i can i truly appreciate you know so we're gonna check this out man appreciate all the love and support i know he has some legendary catchphrases catchphrases let's get right into this one, one two, is this on? on chris jericho is well renowned for his ability to reinvent and freshen up his character Should whenever the it. time is right and throughout his numerous different personas chris has come up with countless different catchphrases and sayings today we'll look back at some of the best of jericho as we count down his top 10 catchphrases first we'll run through some honorable mentions when attempting his signature cocky pin y2j could usually be heard shouting come on baby over that time jericho's been come on baby <laughs> WrestleMania, the tears over his silly scarf to wipe his cheek. Jericho continued running his mouth even when he was wrestling. It was common to see him yell, ask him, to the referee whenever mm -hmm. Chris had his opponent in a submission. <laughs> Look at John! <laughs> Jericho got rid of all his gimmicks and iconic sayings during his 2008 to 2010 heel run. Chris mm -hmm. instead developed two catchphrases that fit his new character incredibly well. Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? Do you understand what I'm saying? This was one of my favorite versions of Jericho. It brought the legendary feud with him and HBK. Oh, he was just so stoic the way he was talking. It wasn't animated he he seems more serious like i love this version of jericho comment down below let me know if you love this version of jericho the slow methodical like like he, he is like he he he's smug like i love this version of jericho bro so goddamn good <laughs> to you right now do you understand what i'm saying to you right now do you understand what I'm saying to you right now. Yeah, we get it. When Jericho said, I'm the best in the world at what I do, it got under the fan's skin and was made worse by the fact that Chris could back up this statement. I am the best in the world at what I do. I am the best in the world at what truth. I do. Have you forgotten that I'm the best in the world at what I do? Huh? It. Whatever it was, Jericho made sure to warn people about it. Sami Zayn is a stupid, itty, it. Better watch it. Watch what? It. I said you better watch it. <laughs> watch what? It. Before we get into the list, this video is kindly sponsored. Hey, shout out to the homie getting that uh, Raid Shadow Legends bag, man. <laughs> and the Ayatollah of Rock oh, and yeah. Roller. Ayatollah Jericho achieved rock and two of his childhood dreams by becoming a wrestler and a rock star. Y2J would remind us of his exploits in the music industry by referring to himself as the Ayatollah of Rock and Roller. The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller! The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller! The Ayatollah of Rock and Roller! The Ayatollah of Rock and Bola! The Ayatollah! Of rock and roller, the Ayatollah of rock and roller. Number nine, will you please shut the hell up? Mm -hmm. When Jericho had heard enough, he would politely demand that the person speaking shut the hell up. Please shut the hell up. Would you please mm -hmm. shut the hell up? Would you please shut the hell up? Would you please shut the hell up? Would you please shut the hell up? 
Number 8. Pronouncing wrestlers' names wrong. When it came to Jericho's opponents, if he wasn't calling them Junior or Ass Clowns, he'd usually be mispronouncing their names. Let's see what you got there, Quasi Juice. First of all, Gene Mean, Skiabone, and Stinko Malenko, <laughs> and Kirk Angel. But seriously, Edgeward, Mitchell Cole, Grayson, <laughs> would you please shut the hell up? Grayson, Sandusky, Santino, San Tokyo, Santino, San Santino, Santa Maria, Santino, San Luis Obispo, Santino, 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 Santino. But what does the Big E stand for? Big Easter Bunny? Big Elephant? Big Edward, Big Utah, Big Urkel, Fan Dumbo, Fan Dangler, Fan Dingo ate my baby o, Fan B I N G Bingo was his name. Number seven, the gift of Jericho. Oh. Drink it in, man. <laughs> oh, that, that was. This was a good version of him with the list. Oh my God, <laughs> the gift of Jericho. Drink it in, man. <laughs> Love this friendship of him too. <laughs> Jericho's 2016-17 run spawned some of his most memorable catchphrases, Facts. including when Chris told us to drink in the gift of Jericho. The gift of Jericho. Drink it in, man. The gift <laughs> of Jericho. Drink, drink it in, in man. man. Bro, wait. Did you see? Hold on. I don't know if y'all saw that. There was a person in the crowd drinking, <laughs> doing this motion. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on. Gift Look. Of <laughs> Look at my guy right here. He drinking drink it, it in. in <laughs> drink it in, man. Drink it in, man. Drink it in, man. Drink it in, man. The line became even more popular as Jericho would think of hilarious ways to alter the phrase so that it fit with the theme of his promo. Welcome back, man! And get in, man! Bring it in, man! Lock it in, man! Try it on, man! Squash them down, man! And lock me in, man! He was marking out, man. Cheer me on, man. Smack it down, man. Say goodbye, man. Get in, man. Drink it. Smell it. Taste it. Live it. The gift of Jericho, man. Just drinking it in. <laughs> Number six, stupid idiot. Jericho is famous for his ability to oh. get even the simplest things over. Calling mm -hmm. someone a stupid idiot might be a more fitting insult for the school playground rather than the wrestling ring. Stupid idiots. I didn't call you idiots. I called you stupid, stupid idiots. idiots. But Jericho's charisma and his delivery of the line was so funny, he just made it work. You don't even mm. work here anymore, it's Teddy Long, you stupid idiot. Stupid <laughs> idiot. Stupid idiot! You disrespectful, stupid idiot. Congratulations, <laughs> Ambrose, you stupid idiot. Stupid idiot. Oh, damn cage match was fucking... Fucking cringe. Idiot. I heard that. You're supposed to. That's a stupid decision. That can only be made by a stupid idiot. Number five, <laughs> filthy, dirty, disgusting, brutal, bottom feeding trash bag hole. Uh -huh. Jericho saved some of his most vicious insults for Stephanie McMahon. Of but course. But there was one line in particular that summed up exactly how Chris felt about Steph. Stephanie McMahon Helmsley is nothing more than oh, no. a filthy, dirty, mm -hmm. disgusting, skanky, brutal, mm. bottom feeding <laughs> trash bag hole. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Number four, best insults. Jericho could go toe to toe with anyone during a promo. Jericho spat bullets on the microphone with his razor sharp wit and always punctual comedic timing. This made it immensely entertaining any time he tears someone down verbally. The only reason anybody bought your book in the first place is they were hoping that you would die at the end of it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Happy ending. I would never, ever, ever hit a woman, but you are not a, a woman. woman. <laughs> And when your body hits the floor, it's usually naked with a paying customer. <laughs> I'm gonna take care of that smelly, greasy, uh, nasty this is a classic animal. One. And I'm gonna get you too, Rhino. I'm gonna be 25. 
No, no, no. I asked you how old you were, not how many men you've been with in the last week. The core <laughs> and the whole. <laughs> <laughs> you're saying that I blew it. I'd have to say you've been doing all the blowing around here, sister. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Can from I have Winnipeg, your attention, you please? Of course you have an email, you idiot. Just read it. <laughs> I can promise you I'll never say anything about your father <clears throat> on this show again. However, your sister... Oh, this is so good. It's almost like your parents got horny while they were watching me beat up Juventud Guerrera 25 years ago, and nine months later, your little twerp ass popped out. I'll even <laughs> have sex with your mother. <laughs> again! <laughs> again. Three, never, ever. Again. I love it. The never, ever again catchphrase mm -hmm. first began to pick up steam in WCW. Will never, right. never, ever, ever happen again. Leading to Jericho bringing it with him to the WWF, mm -hmm. where it found even greater success. It's a phrase the crowd loved to join in with as Jericho's delayed delivery and unique pronunciation just made again. it so entertaining. <laughs> Be the same again. Again. Yes. Again. Yes. Again. Will never ever be the same again. Will never be the same again. Number two, Raw is Jericho. Raw is Jericho. Just like WCW Monday Nitro became Monday Night Jericho. Welcome to Monday Night. Welcome to Monday Night Jericho. It was after joining the WWF in 1999 mm -hmm. that Y2J turned Roy's War into Roy's Raw's Jericho. Jericho. Welcome to Raw is Jericho. 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 <laughs> Bro, he's so good. Raw is Jericho. Welcome to Raw is Jericho. Number one, you just made the list. This, Jericho I, holds the to distinction of authoring five best-selling books <clears throat> and writing two beloved lists. His iconic list of 1,004 holes will be followed up by the legendary list of Jericho, where those who wronged Jericho ended up being put on the list. Mm -hmm. From the build-up to the clicking of the pen to the you just made the list punchline, the crowd ate it up every single time. You know what's going to happen? Uh-oh. Oh, you know what's happening right now? Don't do it! You know what happens because you put Kevin Owens in this match? You know what's going to happen? <laughs> You know what happens? I love Jeez, it. Jeez, McMahon. You know what happens when you touch my personal property, don't you? <laughs> you know what happens when you don't impress Kevin Owens at the Festival of Friendship, huh? You know what happens when you betray Chris Jericho? <laughs> you just made the list. <laughs> no. You just made the list. You just made the list. You know what? You just made the list. Brace face in row 12 <laughs> is now on the list. <laughs> AJ Styles. <laughs> Stupid soccer mom's hair! <laughs> you, you just, just made, made the, the list! list. <laughs> you just made the list! Oh, no. You just made the list! <laughs> oh, no! You just made the list! You just made the list! <laughs> <laughs> The list got a brief spin-off in AEW as uh -huh. the lexicon of Les Champions. Mm -hmm. And who could forget the list of KO, which featured just one name? How come my name's on this? Bro, and you see the sign in the back said, I just made the list. <laughs> it's featured just one name. How come my name's on I this? just made the list in the back. Love it. Chris Jericho will live forever Facts. in an industry of Greenbergs, Kirk Angles, and Stone Cold Steve Ass Clowns. Jericho is the only <laughs> wrestler that can say, I am the best in the world at what I do. Do you understand what I'm saying to you right now? And after all the catchphrases are said and done, after all bottom feeding trash bag hoes have shut the hell up, all the Jerichoholics have drank in the gift of a little bit of the bubbly. Yeah, the episodes of Boys Jericho he had a little bit of the bubbly. <laughs> have ended and all the stupid idiots have made the list we will never ever forget mm. the ayatollah of rock and roller again and that brings us that to was the a good way to her how you as always video, if you man, that was tough the way he combined all of them gotta give a like for that one y'all go subscribe to wrestling flashbacks if you haven't already hey this this list i appreciate videos like this because it just shows you 
how creative Jericho is. He he is without a doubt top ten in some lists, top five. I, I can't I can't not put him in the top ten best one of my favorite wrestlers because the dude is he's just he's good whatever he does wherever he goes dude is fantastic has some good feuds and i i appreciate what he does and has done for the business so comment down below let me know what's your favorite chris jericho uh saying or uh caps phrase but i appreciate all the love and support road to 150k and i am still yeah just be the youtube wrestling champ of the world appreciate y'all kicking me see y'all next one peace